Hey guys, welcome to another vlog of Sustainable Everyday. And today in this vlog, we'll be talking about the use of electric vehicle for public transportation. Guys, today we'll be meeting a very interesting person. His name is Sushil Reddy, and he is a Guinness World Record holder when it comes to sustainability and clean use of solar energy. So he is there on an expedition around India, spreading awareness about sustainability. So currently he is using a auto which is retrofitted with solar technology. So it's a really cool vehicle i've been chasing this guy over linkedin over a period of time so finally he is here in new delhi so let's check it out Guys, we have a normal petrol auto rickshaw here over here, and the driver is confused that how can a auto rickshaw run on solar energy. So let's see what these guys are up to. Hey guys, here with us the man who is behind this great initiative of spreading awareness about the clean use of solar energy on this solar auto which has come so far, Mr. Sushil Reddy. So hi, sir. Hi, so please share your experience that you have come so far on the solar auto how was it and uh, how people are reacting to it so uh, this particular uh, auto is a retrofitted uh, electric auto with a solar panel on the top so this is manufactured by volta automotive india private limited in bangalore and uh, the idea is that we wanted to raise awareness about solar energy electric mobility and clean air and uh, the whole idea of the sun pedal ride awareness journey started from a bicycle and now we are uh, in a rickshaw so uh, 6000 kilometers 60 days that is a target and so far we have done 2500 kilometers in 25 days uh, we started from bangalore on 25th of may and uh, today we are in uh, delhi aero city So the response has been great so far. Uh, people have been very uh, like proactive in trying to understand how this electric vehicle works. Uh, and just to give you a few facts, uh, on one charge you can go up to 120 kilometers. So that's a good enough range for a city use. And uh, the solar panel gives 30 percent of the energy in, in good sunlight. and it takes 4 hours to charge if you don't have sunlight you can just plug it in uh, it's very easy and very easy to drive as well no clutch no gear no moving parts so less maintenance and the best part the operating expense is 50 paise per kilometer so it's very very less compared to a petrol rickshaw which is 3 rupees per kilometer so that's where you save a lot uh, so this company bangalore vipl they are trying to expand into different uh, different uh, regions as well because they have already done the retrofitting process uh, legalized and approved by the rto so this particular rickshaw is uh, already uh, approved by the rto and arai as well okay sir talking about the growing market of electric vehicle in india uh, what are what do you feel what are the shortcomings in terms of technology and how people think so uh, i see uh, some challenges today in electric vehicle industry in india one is the charging infrastructure which is not uh, really there uh, and also the range anxiety so the the electric vehicles today uh, if you are considering for personal use uh, there is a challenge of range anxiety which it's more of a mental block where you don't know like how much kilometers it will run and if it fails the you know the battery stops in the middle of the road you don't know what to do so there are not enough charging stations uh, today that is one of the major challenge and uh, then from the technology side the battery cost it's a very huge expense uh, today even for this particular rickshaw the battery cost approximately 1 lakh rupees uh, that is a major component of the cost uh, if you compare it with the entire uh, vehicle uh, so apart from that uh, i don't see any other challenges uh, so to say 